single most important thing to know about bra sizing is that when you go up a band size, you need to go down a cup size to maintain the same cup volume. Most women don't know this, so they move from, say, a 34C to a 36C and think they just went up a band size, when in actuality, they went up a band size and a cup size. I know this sounds confusing, so let me show you what I'm talking about. Here are four bras with the same cup size D and ascending band sizes. Now most women think all these bras should have the same cup volume because they are all D cups. Well, as you can see, they are not. These D cups are getting bigger as the band sizes increase because the base of the breast gets larger. Now here is the exact same bra style, but this time, as we go up a band size, we are going down a cup size. See how all these cup sizes look the same? Well, they are the same. So let's go back to this earlier exhibit. Why aren't these D cups the same volume for all band sizes? The answer is in the measuring. A cup size is a representation of breast projection, or how far it projects from your body, not how much volume it contains. After all, you measure your body diameter to find your cup size, and every one inch increase is another cup size. As a band gets bigger, the base of your breast too gets wider, and this increases the volume in your cups. So again, a cup letter represents the projection off your chest. So now you know the cup size game. Want to go up a band but keep the same cup volume? Then go up a band but go down a cup size. Conversely, want to go down a band but keep the same cup volume? Go down a band but go up a cup size. And that's the cup size game. Thank you.